Hello. Uh, this is the second lesson in my English pronunciation lesson series. Again, today, like the first lesson, we're going to focus on vowel sounds and two very important ones and two sounds which are often confused. And I hope you've seen my e and i video. Check that out. But Today we're going to focus on oo and oo. So I hope you heard the difference between those two sounds, oo and oo. Right. So these two sounds are commonly confused because one is much longer than the other, and of course in English it's not clear from the spelling always how something should sound like. So let, let's first look at the sound uh, short. Uh, uh. So note the rounded lips here. Uh, uh, uh. And tongue right down at the bottom there. Uh, uh. And uh, you find this sound in words like put or foot. Notice those two O's, which really should be like oo, but in the word foot, it's just that short oo sound. You also find it in words like book, oo, book. Okay, so that's the, the short sound. And the long sound, oo. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. So it's actually almost the same as oo. It's just longer. Ooh. Rounded lips again. Ooh. So, yeah, that's that's how it uh, tends to go. This this kind of sound. Right. So let's think of some nice examples. What about a swimming pool? Where you go swimming. Pool. So, as you see, we had the example of foot with two O's, short, but also pool, two O's, longer sound. So there's lots of examples like that. Uh, if you're cleaning, you might have a broom. Or if everything's miserable and you're sad and you're crying, then maybe you're doomed. Something like that. So, as in the first lesson, I really counsel you to use the phonetic alphabet to different sounds there. Ooh. And ooh. If you don't pronounce them correctly, say something like, you don't say book, you say book. That's not right. People might understand you, but they definitely won't be impressed by your English skills. So I really advise you to try with your ooh and ooh sounds. It's been a pleasure. This has been Charles Wood, English teacher. I love teaching, you love watching. See you soon.